There are approximately 100 plant species associated with Irish hedges, including trees, shrubs, climbers and herbs. John Feehan will tell us more about our hedgerow flora. When it comes to biodiversity, the most important single component in the value of a hedgerow uh, is the permanent, uh, the, the permanent inhabitants of the hedge. We're talking here uh, about the woody species, particularly uh, uh, the, the, the trees and shrubs. Uh, the most important uh, practical plant, hawthorn or whitethorn, uh, for making sure that hedges are, are stockproof, uh, that happens to be one of the most important individual woody species for the maintenance of biodiversity as well. Well, the first flowers you're going to see, uh, well, even from now on, Catherine, but especially from January on, the first flower you're going to see is probably lesser celandine, uh, the golden yellow flower that people often mistake for buttercups, though buttercups aren't in flower yet. So let's just sell and dine. That'll be followed quickly as we're coming into March with primroses. Uh, you have a, a greater stitchwort, white flowers, etc. But by April, the grassy vegetation is beginning to grow up. Uh, so uh, only taller flowers are go going to catch your attention like hogweed, cow parsley, etc. But once you get into the early part of the summer, uh, the vegetation in the ground layer now is going to be so high that the flowers that catch your attention are going to be further up in the hedge and they're going to tend to be uh, clambering or climbing plants such as dog rose uh, or, or bramble or, or, or honeysuckle. Ivy is the last of the hedgerow plants to flower particularly important because at the time of the year when it does flower you know in September, October even into November uh, it's almost the only thing that's producing nectar and pollen for the few insects that are still around at that time of the year.